track in Australian wildlife everyone. Here today we have another goanna or monitor track. This one here is actually a Phenoptes track, a yellow spotted monitor. You can see he's been walking down the road here. You can see the lace monitor we did in the last track had a really thin tail drag. You can see this one here. This is a Phenoptes and he has a really thick tail. You can see the difference in the tail drag. That's how you know the difference in the species of monitor or goanna that we're tracking. So, so we have the Gould's monitor or sand goanna and the yellow spotted monitor or Varanus panoptes. And they're very similar, they almost look identical and they're very similar. But this is definitely a panoptes, it's a large one. It'd be four foot this one. The Gould's very rarely get this large around here. So I'm sure this is actually a panoptes. The tracks look virtually identical. It's just a tiny variation in the tail drag that you can tell and you'd never be able to tell on video. So I can tell just on the ground here with my trained eye that this is definitely a Panoptes or a yellow spotted monitor track. Whereas the lace monitor on the previous video has a long thin tail and it had a really thin tail drag. So, so you can see where he's been walking down the road here. This is just up the back of our house up past the creek. So uh, there you have it, a beautiful Panoptes track, yellow spotted monitor, virtually identical to the Gould's monitor or Sangoanna track. So if you see that track, you'll be a Panoptes or a Sangoanna, so either species. So it's a real privilege, I really wanted to show everyone the difference between the lace monitor and the Sangoanna or yellow spotted monitor tracks. And you can see by that tail drag, it's definitely a Panoptes and not a lace monitor because the lace monitor has a really long tail and it's a lot thinner that tail drag. So. so there you have it. When you know the animals in the area and you know you have a trained eye for tracking and actually pinpoint which species you're tracking and when you're trained you can actually picture in your mind what the animal's been doing. So you see he's actually come down the road here. He's actually foraging as he's looking and he's gone right down there and off into the bush again. I'd say it's early spring so I'd say this animal is a large male and he's actually looking for a mate. So I'd say he's actually following a scent trail down to where there's a receptive female looking for breeding. So, so when you can read tracks properly you can picture in your mind what they're doing. So there you have it, a beautiful Panoptes track, yellow spotted monitor, a very solid goanna species. That's why his tail drag so solid there. So make sure you follow us and we'll share many more tracks for everyone to learn the bush. Thanks for watching, we'll see you next time.